Lillipin. <laughs> I press record. <laughs> Charlie Parsons for Boxing Social in association with William Hill and Empire Fight Store. Ebony Bridges, it's been a while. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Yeah, good. Um, happy to be back and experience an atmosphere. It's just incredible oh, out there tonight. Oh, it's amazing out there. It's so good. Um, I love it. I love the Irish fans. And um, yeah, what a fight to come out to. Um, in terms of just... Uh, boxing big time coming back to Ireland. It's been an awfully long time, yeah. as you will have been informed yes. throughout the week. Um, those fans, I mean, we talk about the fans up north in the UK, yeah. Leeds specifically. Not saying that Leeds fans aren't good, but these are a yeah, breed, and aren't I they? I also think because they haven't had something like this yeah. for so long, it's even more incredible. Like, you know, it was packed out from 6 p.m. Like, it was, no one was missing a beat, you know? Like, they all wanted to be here for the whole time, and it's just, yeah, it's incredible out there. In terms of your next fight, I know you've just touched on it a little yeah. bit there, but what are you thinking? There's some big fights out there. You've got a mandatory out the way. And, yeah, I've got a mandatory out the way, so I wouldn't mind a, um, a voluntary coming back from my hand injury, um, you know, and then, um, yeah, whatever makes sense to me. It's got to make money, money got to make sense, do you know what I mean? And um, I'm at that point now in my career that, you know, I know I am the queen of the division, I'm the, you know what I mean? Everyone wants me, so really the ball's in my court and what I want to do, and, and, and money talks, so I'll fight who I want, but I have to get paid right. What sort of names are you thinking for your well, next fight? I mean, obviously fight? the champions, you know what I mean? But um, I would like to fight, if, if not the champions, you know, Avril Mathie, um, I like the look of her, and I, I like her style, she's tough, and she's, um, you know, I know she went up a weight to fight Ramla, but I think that would be a really exciting fight for the fans. Um, yeah, other than that, you know, obviously the champions, um, not fast, you know. Um, can I ask you, Shannon Courtney's pulled out of her fight yeah. with Nina Hughes. Um, it's had sort of all sorts of reaction on social yeah. media. Um, your thoughts on it? I just, I mean, I, you know, you don't play out of a world title fight for nothing, you know. So she's obviously injured and got something going on. And I hope whatever it is, it gets sorted out soon because I was looking forward to that fight. Fuck, I wanted, I wanted that fight so bad because I want to see, I wanted to win. I wanted to win. I fucking, I wanted to win so I can beat her up and for a fucking belt, you know what I mean? Like, if she didn't have a belt, it just fucking makes it shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, it's just, I really, now it's just going to kind of set it all back a little bit for, for me. You know, I hope she does get the shot again. And I don't want to give her that shot at the belt. I want her to go get a belt and yeah. fight me for a belt. You know, I just think, like, if she was to beat Nina, you know, Unification or even Undisputed, who knows? Do you like the Nina Hughes fight? Yeah, I don't mind in the Nina Hughes fight. I know, know it's a title, but in terms of selling a fight as well, well etc. Not doesn't sell, really. I mean, look, I, I, I don't... Look, I feel like no matter what fight I'm in, I'll sell it. You know what I mean? But it's not me and her. It's not like a, it's not a big fight. You know, I don't think so. I think Dinah Thorsland might be a bit bigger. But, um, yeah, I mean, it might be all right here in the UK, but I just feel like people are going to want to watch me anyways, isn't it? So. Elle Brooke, I've been going yeah. back and forth with. What a great character. Yeah, and her, she's yeah. boxing by storm. Something yeah. that I always sort of talk a little bit about her is she does like deals like badly with self-confidence, especially yeah. in the build-up of fights, etc. And she always <laughs> comes afterwards so frustrated because she knows that she I can know. offer so much more. We see her in um, sparring yeah. and she yeah, almost looks like a pro. Yeah. What sort of advice do you give her moving forward? I just tell her, it's your fucking third fight, babe. Like, you should have seen, like, my first 10 fights or, like, you know, my novice fights or my amateur fights, you know, like, it's, the thing is that she's doing it on such a big stage, she's got a lot of pressure on her, you know what I mean? It's hard, I, even me, like, I remember being like, I just want to be like the pros, like world champions, and you got to just remember, you've got to enjoy the journey and remember where you are. As long as she's working and she's improving, and she is, she's working hard and she's getting better each fight and every training session, that's what she has to focus on, do you know what I mean? There's a lot of pressure for her, I'm, for considering it's really just novice, like she's three fights in. Like when I think about my first three, I didn't ever let anyone come and watch me until I had 10 fights, but as an amateur, because I'm like, I don't want people watching me fight. Are you I won them all except for the one, but yeah, it was still like. Yeah, to go from nothing to them fighting, and, and, and you know the crowds like that. And you're fighting like that. in front of like 10 people yeah. in an amateur. Yeah, she's fighting in fucking like filled out arenas. And they do fill out. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So, and she's judged a lot, you know, so it's, it's tough for her. Finally, from me, the rest of the gym, Johnny Fisher, June 10, and then the rest of the guys. I imagine you're excited. You can't wait to get back working with yeah, them all. Can't wait. Uh, just a word on them all and Johnny for June yeah, 10. Yeah, really, really good. You know, um, obviously, Johnny's fighting in a couple of weeks. Um, um, so I'm really looking forward to that. He's looking really, really good. Johnny Hedges, he's out with his, he had his same hand surgery as me, so he's out for a bit now. But yeah, we're all good. Um, the tips, tips boxing is doing well. Ebony, always a pleasure. Thank you very much Thank for your time. You.